What's going on you guys? This is a Mexican DI here, another Lenovo Think Center M72E. This is the small phone factor. This is the upgrade, so I'm gonna first remove the side cover panel. And there'll be two two thumb screws here in the back, so you're gonna get that removed. You can move the side cover panel, you're gonna slide it to the left. And you're gonna start off, uh, you're gonna move the fan shroud here, so you can see better. And you're gonna smooth the front cover basil here. There's a little clips right here. Your front right here. You press with your finger gently. Just like that. And you're gonna slide it. This slides off like this. And there's a hard drive right here that we will be upgrading also. So first I'm gonna do is start off from the memory. Upgrade the memory. And when you install the memory properly, you're gonna hear two clicks. I'm grading dual channel, eight gigs of RAM, um, DDR3, nine CCM buffer for desktop. And the memory I like is go with either Corsair, Kingston, or Crucial, those are top three brands. So now what we're gonna do is, uh, the power supply in here is 240 watt. For gaming, it'll be perfectly fine. So I'm gonna be upgrading the video card. And the video card, guys, I'm gonna be using is, uh, is a G4 GTX 1050 Ti, and this is the low profile with low profile bracket. This works perfectly fine. So this is the one I'm going to be using, and this is a. Uh, this is you guys. If you want to use the same, you can use the same video card. And what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to slide it to the other side, and what we're going to do is going to move two screws here in the back. And to remove the PCI bracket right here to install the video card. The PCI brackets. Now I'm going to slide it to the other side. I'm just going to leave. Okay, so. Okay, so we install the video card. I'm gonna slide this camera up down a little bit. Man, we're gonna install the video card through PCI Express times 16 slot right here, the top one. That's when we install the video card. Okay, so move the other side. So the video card is installed. Now we're gonna mount the screws back on. Okay, so we did install back the screws back for the VD card. Now what I'm gonna do is uh, we're gonna go to upgrade uh, the hard drive in here. So what I'm gonna do is remove the screws here. There will be two right here on each side, four screws total for the hard drive to remove. It's a 3.5 inch hard drive. But you could also just upgrade to Soul State Drive if you want. So it slides out. Now you disconnect the SATA and power cable. And if you guys want to install the Soul State Drive, you could do that. Then what you have to do is buy this little caddy online. This is metal one. It's uh, from 3.5 inch to 2.5 inch. And what you do is install the two-sided, double-sided uh, double mounting tape in here, foam tape. You can buy a line again. It's a foam, a double-sided foam tape in here. You just, just one in here. You put one in here and one right there. And you just mount it like this to install a solid state drive. Any kind, 2.5 inch will work. And you just connect the cable for the SATA and power like this for the solid state drive. And you just mount it like that. That should work fine. So double-sided foam tape that you guys can use on here, perfectly fine for the solid state drive. So let me get disconnect that. 
sit in power and I'm gonna be upgrading to another newer hard drive. I'll probably go at least one terabyte for the hard drive and let's install it back and and there's a little latch right here you press it down your finger and you install back the screws and so let me go put the screws back on the last screw and you're done so now we're gonna do is make sure to check the old tight the screws are tight okay and okay the SATA power cable is connected now we're gonna put back the front cover basil Install back the front cover basil and we're done. So guys, we upgraded a video card to memory and for now upgraded hard drive. And this is for the Lenovo Think Center M72E. And now we're gonna go ahead and install back the fence shroud here, like this. And install the front cover of the side cover panel. And install back the thumb screws. Okay, so the thumb screws are installed. See so yeah, you guys, this will be the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.